Hello, I'm Kibi Kwan from Taste of Asian Food. In this video, I will show you how to make the drunken chicken roll. The flavor of this chewed appetizer with a high content of alcohol and a myriad of herbs is so intense that it blew me away from the first bite. You may have been served this chicken dish in any Chinese banquet that you attended. Now, you can make it at home with this recipe. This recipe required to use the deboned chicken whole legs. Put the chicken leg skin side down and then make a few cuts on the thick part of the meat. Flatten the chicken leg to get the even thickness. Rub in some salt and season with Shaoxin wine. Marinate for at least an hour before proceeding to the next step. To prepare the soaking liquid, first put the chicken bones in the pot along with other ingredients such as bay leaves, the red dates, ginger, dong guai, fill a small pot with water, and season with salt and sugar. Star anise, simmer for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, filter the liquid through a wire mesh strainer. Then, keep the filtered stock in the refrigerator or until it is cold before use. After an hour, place the chicken on the aluminum foil skin side down. Roll up the aluminum foil like making switch roll. Then twist and fold both ends of the foil. You can also use kitchen twine if you do not want to use aluminum foil. Steam the chicken over medium heat for 20 minutes. You can check the doneness by piercing a sharp object such as a wooden skewer deep into the center of the chicken roll through the aluminum foil. The chicken is cooked if there is no blood oozing out. Another way is to insert a kitchen thermometer. The chicken is done when it reaches 70 degrees Celsius. Next, prepare a pot of ice water. Put the chicken into an ice bath. The ice reduces the temperature immediately and prevents it from overcooking. Unwrap the chicken carefully and transfer the chicken essence inside the foil to the cooking liquid. To make the soaking liquid, add an equal portion of the Shaoxing wine, add the goji berries, and the unwrapped drunken chicken rolls. Keep it refrigerated overnight to let the chicken thoroughly absorb the flavor. On the next day, cut the drunken chicken into half centimeter thick and drizzle some soaking liquid on it as gravy. That's how I make the drunken chicken Chinese style and I hope you will like it. 
You can get the recipe in the description below this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the subscription button and give me a like. Thanks for joining me in this video and I will see you again in another similar video on this channel soon. Bye for now.